Hello and welcome to another exciting video. Some stuff to talk about. I don't know why I had a delay there, but... Um, before we get going, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And, uh, yeah, you'll get all my future videos. And, uh, yeah, let's get into the video. Um, as most of, most of you have already probably clicked away from this video by now, but... <laughs> I know what the analytics are. I see them. <laughs> um, yeah. Y'all always miss the juicy stuff. Um, I'm not pretty far into a drink like uh, last video, but um, yeah. All the things. Uh, what are we going to talk about first? Well, let's talk about Chili Bowl results. You know, that happened over a week ago now. Logan CV was a big winner, winner chicken dinner. Um, I guess he was in the news again this week. Um, he's going to run the um, HUSAC series, I believe, full time uh, non wing sprint car. Um, so that's good for him. Um, I feel like the last time I said the next upcoming late model race was uh, a Lucas race, Lucas Oil race. Um, I was wrong. I don't know why I said Lucas Oil. Probably because I heard someone else say it wrong earlier in the day. Um, it was a World of Outlaws in Volusia this weekend. Gator Nationals, all the things. Um, Devin Moran won two in a row. Um, I think the last night got rained out. Um, some pretty impressive showing so far. So I take out all of the, uh, lapped cars here. <laughs> um... Yeah. So there's that. Um, I did not watch any of the Outlaws races as I do not have dirt on dirt because that's like 300 bucks a year and I don't have that extra kind of cash laying around. If I did, I would have bought myself a PS5 <laughs> and been playing these games on there. Um, and not my trusty old PS4. Um, the PS4 I'm on is uh, um, one of the newer pro models. Um, my other PS4 is uh, like a like a first gen PS4. You know the ones that are like really easy to like get in the hard drive with. Um, you know to pull the top cover off and you know replace it real quick. Uh, it's basically what I did. Uh, <laughs> my other PS4 uh, the hard drive just fried so uh, replaced it put in a, a new I think I only put a 500 gigger in there um, just because my wife is going to use it to um, to play on um, yeah back in our old apartment um, when I had my PlayStation in the living room and she had hers in the bedroom. Yeah, all the things. It's neither here nor there. This is a racing <laughs> game and I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about anymore. Um, Y'all tell me to shut up in the comments, please, because I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Um, just all the things going on. <laughs> Um, but yeah. I'm trying to think of what other racing has been going on. Um, I know there's been some racing going, sprint car racing going on in, uh, um, Australia and New Zealand. Um, I haven't really followed the drivers that are, that went over there to go run. Um, I do know those drivers... 
uh, the drivers that were stuck um, not being able to attend um, we're finally over there and running races and whatnot um, so good for them I guess um, yeah sprint car season hasn't really started yet um, I was watching uh, um, one of the other youtubers uh, uh, dirt tracker daily um, they're saying there might be up to like 16 cars uh, for full timers uh, we'll see how long that lasts um, they have like 10 or 11 confirmed another 5 or 6 that haven't but probably more likely um, I know High Limit picked up a couple more full timers um, a lot of guys who will probably bounce around between the rest of the series or between all the other series um, they'll just run for a championship in the one thing so it's good it's not just Kyle Larson and uh um, uh, Alex Bowman. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Alex Bowman is running full time in that as well with his teammate, but we'll see. Um, he hasn't officially announced that, he just <laughs> he said he's gonna run some races as long as the schedule allows and. I understand, you know, personal things. Plus, you got sponsor things you're always doing all the time. Yeah, even when the drivers aren't in the the seat, they're <laughs> they're working. They're they're doing you know all their their corporate stuff and whatnot. Um, I understand that because racing is a business um, for the entertainment of us. Um, it's a business I would like to get get back into on a way more national scale and not just a little local thing. Although, a little local never hurts. Gotta give back to your roots, all the things. Um, we'll see. I'm still working on some stuff to maybe go racing myself or have someone else go racing for me. Um, we'll see how things shake out right now. Nothing to talk about on that front. Um, but I am looking, guys, so... <laughs> working on some stuff. We'll see. Um... Yeah. What else is going on, guys? Um, oh, things that I mean to talk about for like two weeks now? Maybe three weeks? <laughs> At this point... Um, not dirt related, but open uh, asphalt related. Uh, Kyle Larson is gonna run the uh, um, the Indy 500 next year, for 2024, for Errol McLaren. Um, Hendrick Motorsports is gonna be um, the owner of that particular ride. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if I... I don't think I said something in one of my previous videos, but I don't remember. I don't rewatch them, really. If I do, it's not really with the sound high enough to actually hear myself talk. Um, just to make sure I get the full playback. Um, yeah. Other things going on... Oh, it's looking like... Uh, going to have more than a full field for the Daytona 500. Um, with people like Travis Pastrana running in an open car for 2311. You got Jimmy Johnson running his Legacy MC car. Um, that's going to be an open car. Um, you got that Beard Motorsports entry whose driver name escapes me, but that'll be their first career cup start if they make the field. Um, 
I'm trying to think of who else. Um, oh, Chandler Smith is going to be running an open car for a colleague. Uh, for a third colleague entry. Um, try, <laughs> I'm trying to think of them all. I'm sorry, guys. It's so clean out there. I can't say enough good things about what it's like to share the track with you. Thanks, Tony. Um, yeah. So all the things. I feel like I'm missing a driver to, um, things, teams that aren't confirmed yet, like Team Money Team. Uh, we'll see if they bring that car to life. Um, no news on if that, uh, Hazeman, Heiselman, or however you fucking pronounce that name. The European Champions uh, team. That 27 car. That orange car. Um, don't know if they're going to run or not. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I'm just beating and banging on all these guys, aren't I? These modifieds are wild. Not as wild as... Uh, winner, winner, mac and cheese dinner, by the way. Not as wild as the modifieds in uh, uh, the World of Outlaws game. Uh, probably have one of those uploads here shortly. Um, I tried to record something on Saturday, um, but like I said in my last video, I was busy doing a lot of other things. <laughs> um, I was filming some trains over at the Illinois Railway Museum. Uh, I already have a video of that up, of my trip. It was kind of small. It was like really cold. Wife and daughter came with me. Um, basically my wife and daughter went back into the heat of <laughs> the car and they went back to the car because um, it was way too cold for my little one um, so therefore I didn't stay that long if I went by myself probably would have been there a couple more hours um, done more stuff, filmed some more stuff, but eh, it's okay. I was there for a couple hours. Um, was there for the important parts of the morning. Um, so there was that. Um, yeah. Winter, winter, mac and cheese dinner again. And now to run like one more race here. Green, green, green. Um, yeah, there's not much else going on right now, um, racing wise. Um, at least nothing that comes to my mind. Yeah, just. <laughs> Yeah, this is what happens when I only <laughs> do voiceovers like once a week, if that. Or every week and a half. I don't, uh... I always remember what I've talked about, and then there's either too much for me to talk about or not enough for me to talk about. Uh, I'm glad this video is only about 15 minutes or so. I am just running away with it here. This fucking weird-ass track. Um... But yeah, um, if you made it this far, you're a real one, because I'm a babbling idiot. Um, if you haven't done so, like, comment, and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and winner, winner, mac and cheese dinner. See you in the next one.